Plus breaking news, after days of searching for Emily Rogers, she has been found dead. A vigil expected to take place any minute now outside of her home. We begin with that breaking news. After a five-day search, 23-year-old Emily Rogers has been found dead. She was found in St. Francis after she was last seen at her home at 25th and Beecher. Right now, those who search for her are expected to gather for a vigil at the house to remember the 23-year-old. Madeline O'Neill is there now and joins us live. Maddie? Of course, the worst outcome imaginable to this search, especially for those who know and love Emily Rogers. And I'll show you that vigil is just beginning tonight. A candlelight vigil in honor of the 23-year-old mother just lighting candles here now, starting just around 9 o'clock. And this is at Emily's home. This is where much of the investigation has centered over the past several days at her home at 25th and Beecher, where she was last seen last Tuesday. And not only have police been searching, but family and friends have taken on their own search. In the past week, pleading for answers. Now tonight, police aren't saying where in St. Francis Rogers was found. Rogers was from Texas and had a young daughter. Police say multiple suspects are in custody related to this investigation, but they aren't naming names tonight. And police are sending condolences to loved ones as well tonight. We'll have an update on this story live at 10 o'clock. Live in Milwaukee, Madeline O'Neill, Fox 6 News. Madeline, I know information is scarce right now, but do we know who found her? Was it part of that search party? And that's something we don't know. Just police say she was found in St. Francis, saying they're sending their condolences to the family tonight. Madeline O'Neill, thank you.